Did you guys know that whenever you buy something in the Rush Real Market, you have tons of benefits? You get much better prices than you have in the game client, you can support your favorite content creator with a promo code, and you can also limit the number of your purchases. Instead of several mini transactions, you can just buy yourself platinum and then buy in-game stuff such as gems, passes or deal offers with it. If you want to support me, please use code MONTY whenever you purchase in the market. You can leave me a message that will show on my stream as well. For all the people who uses my code, big thanks. Right. So... We basically want to play it as Spirit Master for Tuna. That's how I would play it. Um, so we have new... Inc new... Um, Inquisitor buff, the light Inquisitor and dark. We are testing light right now. It's one percent more per boss. Okay, so we want statue here and statue over there. That's why we are playing. Um, <clears throat> that's why we are playing Harlequins, so we can set up much easier. Uh, sure didn't happen we can do that we can do that yes and also which magic circle talent level 13 got buffed now after each uh, wave or boss on death wave it's gonna reset uh, so we won't be stuck with it on the tier 7 unit which is nice uh, I do really like this this change Alright, we need one more Inquisitor. Let me do that. Alright, so we have our 7 Inquisitor for debuff, of course. Um, here for the 35% more critical damage and also for Fortuna. So let us start stacking our witches, of course. Oh, I should, should leave always one one of them and uh, so I can copy it with 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 uh, Harley Quinn of course I knew that it's gonna happen all right so let's do that Alright, I guess we can wait a little bit. I'm very curious if... How is that new buff for Inquisitor gonna do? Because honestly, it doesn't sound that much. But, if you think about it... It's quite a good buff. I mean, we can, we can leave this one. If it's tier 3 already, it's fine. So we get 3.5% 3 3 bonus damage now for every boss. So you have to, you want to set up every Light Inquisitor uh, in basically first wave just so you can start stacking. And we will slowly build our our stacks of witch and amulet, of course, because it is also important. We are playing against Faxona, which is, who is also a uh, content creator. Uh, I believe she is a Russian content creator. Never played against her before, uh, but um, yeah, it is quite hard to uh, find people that are willing to play that build um, because of the basically time zones. Different time zones, it's harder to. It's harder to catch with someone for some games on that build. And as you can see, I have new layout for recording. For yeah, for recording, and and also, uh, damn, that's unlucky. Uh, 
nice. Let's do that. And also, I have been editing my my videos in a different app. Hopefully, it's a bit better now. Let's upgrade this. Uh, I'm still learning how to how to edit perfectly in this new app, so hopefully I will get it eventually. Uh, no, no, no. Damn, I'm not very familiar with Inquisitors. So I may make uh, I I might make mistakes, of course. Yeah, that's the problem if you don't leave one witch tier one so we can copy. So we are at wave five, we have already four buffs. Uh, okay. We don't want that, we want witch. For a 50%, it's quite a high chance of getting this buff honestly mm. I mean I can wait a little bit and do something like that and then merge it just for the extra stack okay I cleansed it this time uh, let's merge this getting quite stuck with these uh, with these scrappers so I think I'll chill down for a bit here goes our fifth stack uh, 11 on the amulet of course the witch gets upgrade that's quite annoying uh, and yes, uh, Night Statue also got buffed, I forgot to tell you, uh, it was up to 50 times, it was 0 0.8, now it's 1.2% up to 30 time, times, and then by 0 0.3, uh, endlessly basically. Uh, so yeah, 3 buffs, uh, yeah, which also buff, um, 4 Light Inquisitor uh, can be nice, but I'm not sure if it's going to be enough. That's why I have to test it a little bit more. I definitely could have played it, played this game better, I feel like. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, I'm playing this one correctly. And of course, Witch gets upgrade. It's quite annoying. Alright, another witch buff. We have already 19 of them. It's quite good. Nice, 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 nice. Right, eight buffs, eight buffs. Um I wonder how how long into the death wave we can go. Oh shoot, I don't have ability to plant it unfortunately. I'll just merge it, yeah. Yeah, my night touches are quite low. That's the biggest problem. And I think that's why I'm not dealing as much damage as I should. But maybe we can change that soon. Once we are done with witches, I'll just uh, set up the witches as well. So that should help me as well. Wow, we almost got hit. Surprised. Right, 17 on the amulet. Let's downgrade the scrapper. And 26 on witches. Quite good, quite good. Uh, this guy's tier 2. Statues are tier, tier, tier 3. That's, that hurts a bit, of course.
Hunter Spo a little bit late. Wow, we are not dealing that much damage as I thought. All right, we reached Death Wave. That's that's a good sign, right? Um, yeah, I don't think I can just sit there and wait. All right, we have 28 witches. That's sad. That's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Please downgrade Scrapper. Right. Alright. Statues are tier 4 already, so that's good. I think it's time to set up the witches. Uh, maybe last. Last bit of it. I uh, will leave these touches for the boss. Uh, maybe counter spell will work. Um, don't need witches anymore. Okay, got the witch back. Let's try to get the last witch here. Yeah. Alright, so we are pretty down to all of the things. Oh shoot, I can't really do anything about it. Because I'm stuck with the scrappers. Yeah, so only amulet is left, uh, but it's not that high. It's 20. 3% so we are very close to finishing it. Statues gets upgrades finally. So now it's all about mm, scrapping away and getting the amulet finished. It's 25% now. Alright. Okay, let's wait. Amulet is done. So that's good. Statues are high. Merge rank. Please kill it. Alright. 230. 230 already. It's quite a nice uh, achievement already with Inquisitor, I think. I would really need a cleanse because my units are red sworded. But I'm not getting any Inquisitors, unfortunately. Yeah, the problem with copper is that you, you you are getting stuck often. Alright. Oh god damn it. If I reached five minutes with Inquisitor, I'm already happy, honestly. If I can reach 5 minutes into Death Wave with Inquisitor, oh my no. Yeah, that would be a problem. Because Bedlam screw me over. Alright, yeah, it's cheap. There is no way I can I can do anything about it. Yeah. 3 for 350, sorry, almost 4 minutes. Um Honestly, I don't think it's like it's it's like I thought when I saw the changes. Um, I don't think it's that good. I don't think one percent for Inquisitor is enough to make it work, even with the statue buff. Because at the end, I had pretty much everything. I had my amulet uh, fully stacked. I had my I had my witches stacked. Uh, I had. Uh, all Inquisitors except maybe one on almost a uh, max tier. Max Mare Drunk, so I don't know, like... Doesn't feel right still, even with for Max Fortuna with Max Heroic item. It cannot reach... Uh, it cannot kill a boss at 330. Yeah, 330 boss because it was the last boss, which was Bad Bedlam. 
All right, yeah, uh, that was my test with uh, Light Inquisitor. Uh, let me know what you think, guys, and uh, yeah, see you in the next video. Hey there, thanks for watching, and if you like the video, please subscribe and like, as it helps me a ton. You can also leave a comment if you like, as I read and respond to every comment. Thanks for watching.